All of the following are true about the marked lesion in the CT abdomen except. So this is a CT abdomen where the bones are white. So it's a CT scan. It is a non-contrast CT because this is the aorta which is gray. While in a contrast CT, the aorta will be white. So this is a non-contrast CT where we see this lesion here which is medial to the spleen. This is the spleen on left side. Medial to that and lateral to this diaphragmatic crust is the lesion here. So this is the location of adrenal. So this is a left adrenal lesion. So first we need to know the protocol or the algorithm for adrenal mass identification. So if there is an adrenal mass on a CT scan, on a non-contrast CT, if the HU value is less than 10, it means that it is lipid rich adenoma. So fat will have less HU, less than 10 of an adrenal lesion is suggestive of lipid rich adenoma, which is the most common incidental lesion found on CT abdomen. But if the HU value is more than 10, then we need to calculate the washout. How do we calculate the washout? By comparing the contrast scan and a delayed contrast scan. In a delayed contrast, we see how much is the contrast that is washing out. Adenoma typically has a rapid washout. So if the washout is more than 60%, that means the washout is more. It means that it is an adenoma, but it is lipid poor because the HU is not less than 10, but more than 10. So more than 10 HU, but an increased washout more than 60% is a lipid poor adenoma. And if the washout is less than 60%, then we do not know what the lesion is and we need to biopsy that lesion. So to revise, characteristics of adrenal adenoma are non-contrast CT less than 10 HU, it's a lipid rich adenoma. But if it is more than 10 HU on a non-contrast, then we go ahead with contrast scan and take a 15 minute delayed scan and check for the washout. If it is more than 60%, rapid washout, so it's a lipid poor adenoma. If the washout is less than 60, it is undetermined and needs a biopsy. So now if we see this image, we have the lesion here where the HU value, as you can see, the HU mentioned here is 1.3. So it is less than 10 on a non-contrast scan. So it's a lipid rich adenoma. So the diagnosis is lipid rich adenoma. So the incorrect statement, let us see one by one option. It shows rapid washout of contrast is correct. In phase and out phase MRI is helpful in diagnosis is correct because we've seen previously as well that in phase and out phase MRI is good for fat. So any lesion which contains fat, the in phase out phase MRI helps. If there is fat on out phase MRI, there is a signal drop. The lesion looks dark. Next is majority are lipid rich, correct that we've seen and that is why they have less than 10 HU. And the diagnosis is adrenal cyst. This is incorrect because the diagnosis is lipid rich adrenal adenoma. So adrenal adenoma, it's important to know the imaging features.